Mike Quincy, channeling his higher self, June 1, 2018. The space around you seems empty yet because there are many levels of existence it is in fact alive with many different forms of life. You talk in terms of dimensions for easy understanding, but in reality one vibration smoothly runs into another without any clear division. Each of you is at your own level that is consistent with your present vibration. You reach the higher levels of vibration as a result of your ability to project energy of love that is of the same higher vibrations. By maintaining a constant high level you can evolve even further, to the point where they are so high that you are no longer affected by the lower vibrations around you. It is because the more you can raise your vibrations, the more you are protected by your light that is all-powerful. At your present levels you would be unable to stand in front of highly evolved souls of light unless they lowered their vibrations. For humans their greatest challenge is to come to terms with their ego. Many do not even realize how much their actions are dictated by it. Ego can in fact be in control and acts on behalf of self to the extent that it puts you first in all circumstances. It can be called being selfish without consideration of other people's needs. You could say that as your ego puts you first in all things, you have no objection to being put in that position. However, putting self first sometimes denies others of their right to that experience, so if you are to change the circumstances you must also consider others when making your decisions. When you can truly love others as yourself, you will have gone a long way towards being able to practice universal love. Can you now see that true love for your fellow companions overrides the need to have an active ego that puts self first? As the vibrations upon earth continue to lift up, it will give more strength to those who work in love and light. Conversely the dark ones will be losing their power, and no longer able to interfere with the progress of humanity towards the light. Many other beings from the higher dimensions are waiting their opportunity to help you progress and bring the new age fully into being. Evolutionary progress is your entitlement that you have earned and it shall be yours sooner than you think possible. Much is lined up to propel you further into the new age, and it is an exciting time to be on earth. Looking around you it may not appear so, but from a higher level it is all seen to be waiting the right opportunity to be introduced. It is important that you keep steadfast and focused upon your goal thereby helping to speed up its manifestation. In the long run you will have lost nothing by having been held back, as progress can only be delayed. In the near future you will start to enjoy a series of new inventions that are in course of being made ready for their introduction. As a result life will become easier and more freedom given to pursue your own desires. Perhaps most welcome of all, illness and disease as such will lessen until they will no longer afflict the human race. Already some are enjoying better health in old age and the expectation of old age problems should gradually be left in the past. It is noticeable with some older people that they do not appear to be aging as quickly as others. It can be put down to healthy living and a belief that illness and aging do not necessarily go together. Be aware that your power of thought is growing stronger and you have much more control over your life than you realize. You are now evolving much faster than previously and in time you will become a much greater soul than you have ever been before. It is planned that way and has always been your destiny, and many higher beings are helping you achieve success. The Dark Ones have held you back and have tried to keep you in the dark as to your true capabilities. Older souls are as you might say, feeling their way forwards but have the experience that helps them lift up their vibrations. The Young Ones are in actual fact souls that are bringing in a greater experience with them, and soon to be very active in speeding up the advancements that will truly introduce you to some wonderful new inventions. Nothing can stand in the way of progress anymore and the truth cannot be hidden. Be ready for some astonishing advancements that are ready to be introduced. Things are beginning to change very rapidly on several different levels. It is all part of the onward march that is taking you into new areas of understanding that are necessary to prepare you for what is coming. The struggles and strife of finding your way through the muddle and contradictions that have carried through from the previous age are soon to be cleared away. It will allow many acceptable changes to take place that will lift up the quality of your lives. You are on the verge of benefiting from your wonderful achievement in passing the marker, whereas initially you did not notice any specific changes. It has taken time for things to filter through but many advancements are at the ready and well worth waiting for. 
Remember dear ones that all of you discussed your life plan before you incarnated, and were aware of the challenges you faced. You agreed that they were well within your ability to withstand the outcome, even if at first you failed to succeed. Be assured however that you will always have another opportunity to do better, and there is always help on hand to see you through it. Karma is in no way a punishment but simply a chance to overcome failed challenges, so that having done so you can still make progress with your evolution. The immediate benefit is that when you have cleared your karma, you can continue evolving as you make your way to the higher dimensions. When you have broken free from the lower vibrations, you will dwell at a level where you no longer have karma to clear. The future is beckoning and will release you from all of the negativity you have become involved in. As experience it has helped your evolution and is most welcome, and it enables you to help others that follow in your footsteps. You should never have to go back to the lower dimension, and will find peace and happiness in the higher ones. Soon you would forget the hard times you experienced and eventually they would fade into the distance. As intimated previously some souls gladly go back to the lower dimensions, to help struggling souls to overcome their dilemma and find the light. In the extreme it means entering those levels where light barely exists, so much so that the task is often passed to angelic beings. On the one hand time seems to be passing slowly where progress is concerned, yet behind the scenes so much is happening that is bringing the future into being. I leave you with love and blessings, and may the light brighten your days and path to completion. This message comes through my higher self, my God self, and every soul has the same connection to God. In Love and Light Mike Quincy Website, Tree of the Golden Light Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Click the bell icon at the top of the page to get notified when I post a new video. Universal Channeling Channeling the Conscious Universe